Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm going to go ahead and see what comes out for you guys. Alright, Holy Spirit, so what's the situation here? Alright, wow, so we got the Eight of Cups. So apparently somebody is truly walking away from a situation. Um, it could have been a lot of conflict with the Five of Wands. Somebody could have had a fight here. I feel like the will is now turning in your favor here. Um, somebody could be also walking away from somebody that was very toxic here. Wow. Yeah, they're moving on here. The High Priestess. So somebody was not emotionally fulfilled in a situation here. This could be an end of a relationship. Somebody could also be abandoning something. Somebody also may could be doing some traveling here. It's going to be different for all of y'all. Yeah. About to say who's all involved. And we got the King of Wands come flying out. So this definitely could be you walking away from a masculine energy. Or this masculine is walking away from you. We got the King of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck with the Six of Cups. So this is definitely somebody from your past here. What was the blockage here? All right. Wow. So the blockage here was somebody did not speak their truth here. It wasn't any type of clarity in this dynamic, whatever this could have been for you. Yeah, with the Nine of Cups here. The Nine of Wands and the Six of Wands. Somebody could have been in their ego. This could have been a connection where it was only sex-based here. But I feel like it was no clarity or maybe no harmony in this dynamic here. Somebody couldn't make a decision or a sound decision. Wow. What was the hindrance here? Yeah, the Seven of Cups. It's like somebody was in a fantasy world or in La La Land or somebody had a lot of options or something like that. Yeah, they were in some type of mental prison here. Okay. Okay. Wow. Somebody needs to make a decision. I feel like they were having a hard time doing that. Yeah, we got the Hermit with the Lovers here and the Two of Cups. So this definitely could have been some type of um, hmm, third party situation, love triangle, something like that. Somebody had a choice in love, okay? Two of Cups to the Three of Swords. Yeah, this was a third party. And I feel like somebody here, they didn't tell the truth, so... They had to walk away from you. Or you found out the truth and walked away from them. Something like that. You listen to your intuition here. Because you could have been asking this person or something like that. And they could have been denying it. Yeah, you single. Nine of Pentacles here, love. Wow. Let's keep going here. So what is this Eight of Cups doing here? As I say, eight of cup in it, okay? Yeah, we got the devil here. <sighs> Maybe some of you guys are walking away from some of your addictions. We got justice here. Um, maybe some of you guys were focusing on material things or you just had negative thinking. You could have felt trapped in bondage here or it was some type of betrayal. And I feel like with the Knight of Pentacles, you've been dealing with this for a long time, but now the scales are about to be balanced. Some of you guys also could have been dealing with legal issues as well with the justice system. Some of you guys could be realizing that it is a cause and effect to everything you do. You learned some type of life lesson here. Wow. What's the Knight of Pentacles here? Yeah, look at that. Somebody could have betrayed somebody here with the Ten of Swords and you could have been in a mental prison. You could have felt stuck. Yeah, we got the Emperor here. This person definitely could have been like emotionally blocked off to you with the Two of Swords here. And they could have been hiding somebody they were dealing with in the background. Take it how it resonates. Queen of Wands to the Judgment. Ace of Cups to the Will of Fortune with the Death card here. So this person was definitely confused. They needed to make a choice. Maybe they didn't want to make a choice here. I just want to know what the devil is. Yeah. Wow. Queen of Swords. Who's the Queen of Swords? The Four of Wands. So this could be somebody that they're married to. Yeah, this marriage is under judgment or something like that here. If somebody was dealing with somebody in a, in a marriage, it's like if they left you or they didn't tell you, number one, that they were married, that they had a family, they're now stuck in this situation. They're both under judgment. The whole damn family is under judgment here. Wow. 
What's this King of Wands doing here? I feel like whoever this is, they're trying to heal. They're trying to gain their confidence. This could be somebody that wants to come towards you. But I feel like they already know they missed an opportunity here. Yeah, this thing is being laid to rest. You could be holding back. They're holding back or something like that. Yeah, I feel like it's you that's holding back from this person. And you turned your back here. You're now moving forward here in silence, getting balanced with the yin and the yang here, the sun and the moon. I feel like your ships are now starting to come in and you're moving towards your wish fulfillment with the nine of cups here. You could be going towards a king of swords here. Someone that's very smart, intellectual, very witty. What's this ace of swords? What was the hindrance here? What was not told here? What was the lie? Damn, ten of pentacles in reverse. Yeah, somebody lied about having a family or something like that. And they could have been love bombing you, okay? <laughs> Romancing you, being very charming. Left you in some type of regret here or something like that here. The truth was not spoken. I feel like with the Ten of Pentacles in reverse, it's like... It's some type of loss that happened or a family feud or it was restricted. Or there's definitely a separation due to somebody not being honest here. What's the Ten of Pentacles in reverse? This is not a solid foundation here. Yeah, somebody got wounded with the Nine of Wands here. Could have been you. You could be the Queen of Pentacles High Priestess here to the full card. Somebody was not honest about something. Somebody was truly a mistress here, bruh. Yeah, it was a third party. Three of Cups here. Somebody was truly juggling. And somebody had to be left out in the cold. And apparently they left you out in the cold. And the tower fell here. Because the secret is now out. This individual also could have blocked you as well. Yeah. Ace of Wands to the moon. I feel like this connection was only sex based. Okay. You were only in position until this person went back to somebody else or something like that here. Damn. What's the tower here? Yeah. The Six of Wands. It was no victory here. Somebody was in their ego and your spirit guides had to move you away from this situation here very quickly. And I feel like this person is watching you here. They know you know that they were being deceptive and very manipulative here. This is somebody that started something with you and didn't finish it because they had a lot of secrets. They were the Knight of Wands rushing in, rushing out. And somebody had to draw the line in the sand here. Could have been you or your spirit team here. The hindrance was somebody had a lot of choices or a lot of options or there was a lot of delusion going on here. Yep, with the Ten of Cups and the Ace of Pentacles here and the world. Yeah. You could have been thinking that you were going to have something with this person. This was going to be a new beginning for you. Ten of Cups to the Ace of Pentacles with the world. But I feel like you, you came out of that illusion and realized that this thing ain't going nowhere. Okay. Somebody is already committed to a marriage. Yeah, the hell fine. And this got revealed to you. You were the other lover here. And I feel like you just could have, you know what I'm saying, turned your back and started working, mastering yourself. You could have felt stuck here. You gained some type of new perspective, maybe even master your emotions. I feel like you definitely grieved the situation and now you're turning your back. I feel like you may deal with some type of anxiety as well about this situation here. And you're trying to be strong. I feel like you're now speaking your truth here with the King of Swords energy. Um, I feel like you're now getting stabled and you feel a little more secure. You could be adapting to a situation. Some of you guys could have got pregnant or you could be pregnant. Or you just could be in the Empress energy. Yeah, somebody could be pregnant here, going to be giving birth and the wheel is turning. Yeah, Nine of Cups with the Temperance. Ooh -wee. Tell me about the Nine of Pentacles here. Yeah, you're trying to be strong here. You're trying to adapt to the situation here. Yeah, because you're moving forward here. You done already grieved over this King of Cups energy. They're stuck. Okay? Whatever work they were doing, they're now stuck in their head about it. We got the Empress here. They try to collaborate with you. This could have been a baby mama. You could have been the Queen of Cups to wish fulfillment. But this person was carrying a lot of heavy burdens here. And I feel like you're moving forward here to have a new beginning with someone new here. We got the King of Pentacles, Ace of Wands with the Two of Cups. I feel like somebody wanted you to feel defeated here, but you...